Hello and welcome to yet another video on the identification of plant parasitic nematodes and this time from the genus Paratilenchus. In the first part, we will briefly go through the major diagnostic features useful in identifying nematodes from the genus Paratilenchus. It is important to note that, unlike other plant parasitic nematodes, morphological identification of Paratilenchus is affected by the limited number of diagnostic features present. However, we can rely on some characters to effectively identify Paratilenchus nematodes to the genus level. These characters include size, whereby Paratilenchus is quite small compared to other co-occurring plant parasitic nematodes. Another character is the typical general shape. They can also be characterized by varying lengths of the stylet depending on the species. Other characteristics include a continuous labial region, and a usually weak labial framework. In this second part of the video, we will observe these characters in detail with the aid of a microscope. At this level of magnification, we can observe the size of the nematode, which in this case is generally small. We can also see the typical general shape, and also the position of the valve. However, due to the limited diagnostic features within this genus, there is no other unique feature to observe. We can however still observe the stylet, of which in this case is short. We can also see a continuous labial region and a weak labial framework. Here is a more clear illustration under a higher magnification. To conclude, due to lack of enough diagnostic features, it takes practice to confidently identify nematodes of this genera. Thank you for watching.